welcome to our youtube channel today i am going to explain class 9 9 uh, science paper essay 2 science paper first main they have they have given multiple choice question and first question uh, by seeing the distance time graph you have to write time taken by the car to travel the distance from 10 kilometers to 15 kilometer answer is option c 10 minutes second one weight of an object is Answer is option A, force acting vertically downwards. Third one, the energy transformation observed in a working electric heater is option C, electric energy to heat energy. And fourth one, you have to find out the total displacement. Then you have to all add all the distance cover covered by the body like 6 km plus 4 km plus 8 km and total it is 18 km. Then you have to find out the energy consumed. And sixth one, what should be the minimum distance between the obstacle and the source of the sound to hear the echo? It is 17.2 meters. Seventh one, uh, by seeing the velocity time graph of ball moving uh, of mass 10 kg moving along the straight line and a long table is given. So you have to find out the force uh, does the table exert on the ball to bring it to the rest. And eighth one. A feather of the bird and a rubber ball are dropped at the same time from the top of a building. Which one will fall, reach the earth first and why? Uh, both of them are hit the ground at the same time because uh, in the absence of viscosity, both uh, rubber ball and uh, bird, feather of the bird both will experience the same acceleration due to gravity. So both of them will reach the ground at the same time. Ninth one, state the Newton's third law of motion and give two examples to it. Newton's third law of motion is for every action there is an equal and opposite reaction. Example, when you hit the wall with a ball uh, by applying some force, with the same force the ball will bounce from the wall. And another example, during swimming when you push the water downwards with a force, with the same force the water pushes the body forward. Tenth one, state the universal law of gravitation and write its importance. Universal law of gravitation is every object attract uh, another object. The force of attraction between two objects is directly proportional to product of their masses and inversely proportional to square root of their uh, distance. And its importance is uh, this uh, law of gravitation binds us to the earth, binds us to the earth and uh, it helps to revolving of the planets around the sun. It also helps to revolving of the moon around the planets. It also helps to arises of the tides and waves. Next, the difference between potential and kinetic energy. Potential energy, uh, the energy possessed by the body by virtue of its position. Kinetic energy, energy possessed by the body by virtue of its motion. Object increases its energy and rise through height because uh, in potential energy, uh, potential energy is equal to mgs, mass into gravity, acceleration due to gravity into height. When height increases and uh, this potential energy will also increase. And 12th one, uh, rate of change of velocity formula they, they asked. Rate of change of velocity is nothing but acceleration. Acceleration is equal to final velocity minus uh, initial velocity divided by time. V minus U divided by T. And three equation of motion is um, V is equal to U plus AT. S is equal to UT plus half AT square. V square is equal to U square plus 2AS. Thirteenth one, expand the acronym SONAR. How SONAR can be used to determine the distance of the underwater objects? Explain. Uh, sonar is sound navigation and uh, ranging. This uh, sonar, uh, in the bottom of the sonar, it is having transducer or emitter and also it is having a receiver. This transu transducer or emitter, it will emit the or it will send the ultrasonic waves into the sea and these waves travels through the sea water. When they hit any object or uh, surface of the sea, they will come back or bounce uh, from the object. After the receiver present in the sonar, it helps to receive uh, those ultrasonic waves and converts them into electrical signals. So by this we can find out the distance of the underwater objects. And 14, uh, when it comes to chemistry part, 14th one, boiling point of water in Kelvin cycle, Kelvin scale is B, 373 Kelvin. 
फिफ्टीन राइट स्टेटमेंट रिलेटेड टू प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ कोलाइड अमंग द फॉलोइंग इज ऑप्शन ए मेक्स द पाथ विजिबल बाय स्कैटरिंग द बीम ऑफ लाइट एथ वन सिक्सटीन गिव रीजन अवर पाम फील्स कोल्ड वेन सम पेट्रोल इट पुट पुट ऑन इट वाई सो बिकॉज दिस पेट्रोल ड्यूरिंग एवापरेशन फ्रॉम द पाम इट विल अब्सॉर्व द हीट ऑफ द पाम दैट्स वाई वी फील कोल्ड एंड सेवेंटीन वन वॉट इज द रीजन फॉर क्लासीफाइंग जर्मेनियम एज ए मेटलॉइड जर्मेनियम इट एक्ट एज बोथ मेटल एंड नॉन मेटल दैट मीन्स इट शोज द प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ बोथ मेटल एंड नॉन मेटल सो दैट्स वाई इट इज कंसिडर्ड एज मेटलॉइड एटीन वन अब्सर्व द स्कीमेटिक अटामिक स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ टू एलिमेंट्स इवन हियर एंड आंसर द क्वेश्चन दैट फॉलो फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन हाउ डज द एलिमेंट ए अटेन ए फुल्ली फिल्ड आउटर मोस्ट शेल एलिमेंट ए इट इज हैविंग सिक्स सेवन इलेक्ट्रॉन्स इन द आउटर मोस्ट शेल टू अटेन ऑक्टेट स्ट्रक्चर टू ऑप्टेन एट इलेक्ट्रॉन्स इन द आउटर मोस्ट शेल आइदर बै लूजिंग द इलेक्ट्रॉन्स आर गेनिंग द इलेक्ट्रॉन्स आर बै शेरिंग द इलेक्ट्रॉन्स इट कैन अटेन द ऑक्टेट स्ट्रक्चर and uh, b question second question element b shows a little chemical reactivity why because element b it is having eight electrons in the outermost shell and that is called as a uh, octet configuration or octet structure so when uh, element attains the octet configuration it won't react with any other elements because it is stable in the 19th question carbon 12 and carbon 14 are isotopes why and mention the application of isotopes uranium and iodine Uh, carbon 12 and 14 are isotopes because they are having same atomic number but different atomic mass and iodine isotope it is used to treat thyroid cancer the cancer which is related to thyroid and uranium which is uh, used as a nuclear weapon or fuel nuclear fuel to produce electricity in 20th uh, they have given a flow chart that why uh, conversion from liquid to solid is called as solidification and x conversion from gas to solid is called as sublimation and z conversion from liquid to gas is vaporization so name the process x and y x is a sublimation and y is a solidification what is the name of the process z that takes place before the liquid reaches the boiling point that is evaporation and mention any two factors which affect this process evaporation is affected by temperature surface area humidity and also wind speed and molecular formula for the following compounds 21st question common salt it is nacl sodium oxide it is na2o aluminum sulfate is al2so4 thrice next 22nd question <coughs> define the following a molecule is a substance that cannot be broke down into simpler by chemical means atomicity is the number of atoms in the molecules of an element ions an atom or group of atoms that has an electric charge next uh, 23rd you have to write the diagram of fractional distillation and you have to label the fractionating column and water contents 24th question you have to write the schematic representation of nitrogen cycle uh then comes to biology portion biology part 25th a student identifies it as a colon chyma when he observed a chart of the tissue in the classroom because option d cells are thickened at the corners 26 uh, correct pair related to disease or symptoms and the target organs is the following first one option a cough and uh, breathlessness is uh, lungs 27th an advantage of using fertilizer is option c supplies large quantities of nutrients to the soil and next 28th question an animal with a three chambered heart has mucus glands in skin to which class do you add this animal so three chambered heart and uh, has mucus glands in the skin means it is uh, belongs to amphibia and uh, they can respire through skin and they can also respire through gills when they are present in water and when they are present in land when they are uh, comes to land they'll uh, breathe through the or uh, respire through the lungs 29th what are chronic diseases chronic diseases uh, there are uh, gradual onset and long lasting diseases they can stay for the longer time and what is intercropping intercropping is growing two or more crops in the same field simultaneously in a definite pattern and next 31st question write any two difference between striated and unstriated muscles 
uh, striated muscles are also called as uh, skeletal muscles uh, these muscles which are having cross bands uh, light and dark uh, cross bands unstriated muscles they are also called as smooth muscles uh, they do not contain any light and uh, dark uh, cross bands and these uh, striated muscles are cylindrical in shape unstriated muscles are uh, spindle in shape and one more we can say uh, striated muscles are multinucleated contain many nucleus and unstriated muscles they are having only one nucleus they are called as uninucleated and next 32 uh, 32nd question plant cell is placed in concentrated salt solution what changes do you observe and name this phenomena so plant cell is placed in uh, concentrated salt solution means uh, that concentrated salt solution is uh, hypertonic solution so when you place the cell in that uh, hypertonic solution that uh, cell will shrink so the shrinkage of uh, cell will occur and uh, this phenomena we usually usually call it as uh, osmosis or diffusion 33 or personal and social health can be maintained by preventing the infectious uh, diseases and justify this statement so personal and health can be maintained by preventing uh, because uh, these infectious uh, diseases easy easily they'll uh, spread from one person to another person so we have to control the spreading of diseases by maintaining the social distance or by wearing a mask and uh, isolating the infected person uh, and also maintaining the personal hygienic and uh, surrounding hygienic so by do doing all these things we can maintain the personal and social health and uh, 34th question write any two desirable traits observed during the variety improvement in poultry farming by crossing indian and foreign breeds so in poultry farming uh, our main intention is to increase uh, quality and quantity of meat and increase the number of eggs and also increase the number of chicks. Next, you have to write the diagram of animal cell and you have to label the powerhouse, means mitochondria and nucleus. Next, 36th question. Observe the cross-sectional diagram of leaf and answer the questions. So, the P labeled uh, part is uh, stomata. Uh, stomata, it is having a pore are open uh, in the center and it is surrounded by a bean shaped cells are called as uh, guard cells and this uh, stomata it helps in uh, gaseous exchange uh, during the photosynthesis carbon dioxide will uh, come inside and uh, oxygen will go outside through the stomata and also helps in uh, transpiration to remove the excess of water from the plant 37 what is hybridization of plants hybridization means crossing uh, uh, different varieties of plants to obtain uh, desirable characters uh, characters containing plant and four factors b uh, four factors which are considered during the variety improvement of crop yield is one is wider adaptability and second one is uh, disease resistant and next uh, higher quality and quantity and also we need desirable agronomic characters and 38th question first one a is write any two characteristics of uh, pisces and reptiles pisces means fishes fishes respire, respire through gills and they are aquatic exclusively aquatic they are present only in water they are oviparous that means they lay eggs and they have streamlined body and heart uh, it is having two chambers when it comes to reptiles they will respire through lungs they are terrestrial means they can present on land they are also oviparous means they lay eggs and body it is covered with scales and the heart is three chambered so they are having three chambered heart and uh, b 38th b identify the phylum of the organism with the following characteristics first one spiny skinned animal it is echinodermata and second one animals with a jointed leg means it is arthropoda